Hello, my name is Steve Bigelow with the Candlestick Forum. Today we're going to take a look at one of the high probability trade setups using candlestick signals and patterns, the doji sandwich signal. It is very easy to identify. Usually you see a big bullish candle followed by a doji. And then we utilize one of the strong implication uh, uh, doji rule, which is simply that the price or the trend will usually move in the direction of how they open after a doji. This makes for a very simple, easy to identify three day pattern a big bullish candle followed by a doji. Then we know if the it, price opens positive after the doji it's probably going to move positive. And the magnitude of this move is usually the magnitude of this move with the doji sandwiched in between. When you combine the factor that if you have a strong reversal signal and then a doji, and even if the doji is sitting right smack dab on a resistance level, it makes it very simple. If it opens positive the next day, the probabilities, because of the doji rule, says it's going to trade positive, which usually means this resistance level is not going to act as resistance anymore. And the doji sandwich has very uh, strong expectations that there's going to be more upside. So witnessing a strong signal and then a doji type day right on a major resistance level the guesswork is eliminated because if we know it opens positive, it's going to trade positive. And if it's going to trade positive, it's going to do the same magnitude as this day right here, which means this level right here is not a resistance anymore. We start looking for the next resistance level. The implication can be true for the downside. A big down day and a doji, if it opens lower, what's it tell us about our T-line? There's no support there. You probably have more downside, which confirms the fact that it resisted at the 50-day uh, moving average. So you can be prepared for a high probability trade setup and get in at the ultimate uh, time based upon how it opens the next day after that doji. We're seeing a doji sandwich closing right at the T-line. If our expectations are more upside, if it starts trading positive from there, it's confirming our reversal signal, the doji sandwich, and telling us the t line's not acting as resistance anymore. The expectation of positive trading after a doji, after the bullish candle doji setup, allows the candlestick investor to get in early in the trade setup knowing the probabilities are pretty strong, there's going to be more upside. The doji sandwich is a very high probability signal and a very easy trade setup to get in at the ultimate time. Thank you for watching.